Welcome to Mech Warrior Online. This is Fuzzy Nova, and today we've got the Hunchback 4G. Yeah, we are doing a real classic one today. Um, and I want to do a video because uh, I got to head into work here actually very soon. And I wanted to do a drop or two if I have time um, since I haven't put out a video in a couple days. Usually on the weekends, Thursday and Friday and Saturdays are my days where I do most of my videos. But I haven't had much time. Easter's tomorrow. So happy Easter, everyone. And uh, yeah, but the Hunchback, um, it's just a classic MechWarrior Online mech. It's probably one of the most well-known mediums that there is, um, and it's got a cool design. The design is is is, is classic. It's it's genuine. It's it's a freaking Hunchback, the Inner Sphere Hunchback. So let's go ahead and take a look at the build here, and we're going to talk about the 4G and the 4H, because some pilots will say that the 4H is better than the 4G. Um, and I think that the 4G was actually manufactured first. Um, so I think this is like the original Hunchback right here. We've, for the 4G, we've got three ballistic and three energy. Now, um... Ugh. Your ballistics are in your right torso, that's where that hunch is at. And now the 4H has one ballistic and five energy, and this has three ballistic and three energy. Since I'm using an LBX-20 and three ER medium lasers, it seems as if the 4H may have been a better pick for this build, but I didn't realize that until after I bought the 4G, so we're going to have to use what we got. And this is almost a stock build. This is a, almost exactly what the, 4, the 4G came with. Um, it came with an AC-20 and three, no wait, it came with an AC-20, I think two medium lasers and a small or something like that. Anyways, it's pretty close to the stock build. Um, I just amped everything up. I made it a little bit better. Instead of our AC-20, we've got an LBX-20 in our right torso and three ER medium lasers, along with four double heat sinks and four and a half tons of ammo. So that's quite quite the uh, the upgrade there from what it was because you're gonna want double heat sinks with this um, even though ballistics don't rack up too much heat uh, your ER mediums in the LBX 20 is gonna rack up a little bit we've got Indo steel and 64.8 uh, kph is standard speed with a standard 200 engine uh, armor points we've got plus 18 armor in our right torso to protect that LBX 20 um, 58 in the CT 43 in the left torso 32 in the arms 40 in the legs 18 in the head um, but yeah our heat management's really good with this it's uh, let's see 1.54 out of 2 uh, if you want to sacrifice some double heat sinks for that wouldn't be a bad idea but um, yeah I didn't really know what I was gonna do with this when I got it uh, I just knew I wanted a hunchback and um, so I just got the 4G because it was the first one that came to mind. The 4H might be better than this because it does come with 5 energy and it does give you more options to do. But at the same time, 3 ballistics on a 4G, unless you're using triple AC2s or maybe dual AC5s, I really don't see you putting triple ballistics on this because of uh, the tonnage and how much room there is. Um, unless you upgraded your engine. Uh, to save some tonnage you might be able to fit three of something on there three AC fives I'm not sure I'm really not um, but the 4G is still a great mech and it's a it's a uh, cleanup mech that's what I've noticed with well, at least this build is um, and the stock build was almost exactly the same it's uh, very uh, come in afterwards and to clean up the enemy mechs kind of build uh, you can play it whatever way you want but Heading straight on into the enemy is usually going to get you an early death in this. Uh, the LBX-20 does have a nice punch to it, but it's slow rate of fire and just three ER medium lasers uh, really isn't enough to take a mech down from the start. Uh, you're going to want to you're going to want to come in midway and just you know kind of clean up a little bit, depending on how the match goes. Sometimes you can't help it, and sitting around idle sometimes can really be uh, a bore. I've noticed. I don't like sitting there and waiting. Um, so, but the 4G, we're gonna do a drop in it, and we'll see you guys on the battlefield.
Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. And we are on Canyon Network in the Hunchback 4G. And I will have time for one match before I got to go to work. So we're going to do this match, and that's going to be it. So um, I was thinking, you know. It's crazy because the clan version of the Hunchback, the Hunchback 2C, um, can hold two LBX-20s, and it's roughly the same size. So it's, it feels like it's an unfair advantage. Um, but nevertheless, this is still a great mech. Um, and this build is definitely a cleanup build. Definitely is. Um, you can still use it, you know, brawl a little bit, uh, use a little bit of support, but... Uh, Kind of let the big guys do their thing for a while. Um, don't don't get in there. There's some mechs that you can, you know, that I use that I get in there and I brawl really well. And then there's just some mechs that you really don't want to do that with. And that's this one. New target acquired. So we're going to go ahead. I need to be careful here. LBX 20s have a a long range, but the further the range, the less damage it does. I'm gonna take. Uh, little peek here God, there's a lot of urban mechs uh, all of alpha was um, all urbies I've seen that a lot because of that freaking event going on I'm gonna claim this as my spot and um, New target acquired. hopefully get a kill or two. Oh, that roughneck's right there. Gotta watch these lerms here. Freaking lerms, man. Ooh. It, it has a really nasty punch. And to a mech that's already damaged or at half health, this thing is going to bring it down. Um, to a healthy mech, to a 100% mech, or 90%, or even 80%, it can take some... Uh, some finesse to get them down. That's why, like the Hunchback 2C, um, which is able to carry two LBX 20s um, or two Ultra AC 20s, is such a such a dangerous dangerous medium. I wish I could have two LBX 20s on this. I'm trying to watch my damage here. Um, Another common thing in the 4G is having your ballistic hardpoint completely destroyed. As you can tell, my right torso is hurting. It's a big old target. Pow, right in the kisser. Right. Pop him again. Got him. Got him. Got you, sucker. Killing blow. Let's see if we can get another here. You will die. Got him. Got him. I don't know how that I I took the shot and he died two seconds after I after I shot. I'm not sure what that was. It was like an altered effect. Irby! Oh! These these damn urban mechs, they are really they are strong. They can take they can take a beating. And uh Yeah, don't mistake them for their size. They can do some damage. Um, although I'm not a fan, really a fan of the urban mech. Um, a lot of people are. Bushwhacka. Bring him down. Surprised that didn't kill him. Oh, I lost my. Yep, there goes my ballistics and my right shoulder. I've got two ER mediums left. That's what you got to watch out for. It's gonna happen a lot. Um, if you can try to spread most of your damage to your left side, which I didn't do this match that that well. Otherwise, I'd still have my ballistic. But um, we are. Yep, seven to four. We are. Catching up there. Target destroyed. New target acquired.
there's four of them left, and I'm trying to... Okay, we got that guy right there. I just got hit with the PPC. Where the fuck did that come from? Ah, I just got hit again. Oh, there's an urban mech over there. Left torso, critical damage. Oh, sucker. Hey! Oh, no, no, no. Center torso, critical damage. Yeah, roger that. We've got an Irby over here. Is Viper still running around? What the hell? There we go. Target acquired. Yeah, the Hunchback. It's a it's a good mech. It really is. Um, it, it'd make a good first mech too. Although I would definitely recommend the, the Hunchback 2C. Uh, but if you're a fan of Inner Sphere mechs, um, I can see you going with the Hunchback. It's a good mech, and he killed himself. But 12 to 4, we totally dominated that. And um, yeah, you know what? I'll play another match. You know what? Fuck it. I'll be late to work. Two kills, ten assists, 339 damage. Not as great as I wanted to do with damage wise. But, uh, yeah, it's still a good mech. Good build. It's a, it's a pretty powerful build. I enjoy it. Um, let's go ahead and hurry up and play another match here. Uh, I'll play one more. So we'll see you in the next match. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Frozen City. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. One LBX-20, three ER medium lasers. Let's rock it. Oh. Target acquired. Yeah, so happy Easter, everyone. I hope everyone's going to have a good Easter. Tomorrow is Easter. Some people celebrate it more than others, Acquired. just depending on certain things. But every day is a good day for Mech Warrior, and I'll, I'll probably be playing some tomorrow. I gotta work tomorrow too. I gotta work on Easter. How shitty is that? I know, right? I, I do work a lot, and I do try to put out videos as much as I can with the time that I have, and um, you know. As I said earlier, um, some people, some pilots will, will say that the Hunchback 4H is better than the 4G. But what I didn't realize is when I got the 4G, I really wasn't paying attention. I really wasn't paying attention to much. I just said I want to do a Hunchback variant, and the 4G was the first one I saw, so I just bought it. Um, normally, I put a little bit more effort into um, choosing the mechs that I that I showcase. But uh, the 4H comes with one ballistic and five energy. This comes with three ballistic and three energy. But the thing is, is I can, as I said, I can see you putting three AC2s on this, um, but nothing else. Unless you're doing machine guns, and machine guns on a hunchback is just not. I'm not feeling that. I don't see. I don't think that'd be a good idea. So, making use of those three. I would have, I would have gone, I would have, excuse me, I would have had a better option if I would have gone with the 4H. With this, I could have had two more ER mediums along with my LBX-20. But I did the 4G, and uh, this is really, as I said, this is really close to the stock build. I came with an AC-20 ER mediums, and I think like a small laser or something like that. Um, target acquired. But this is definitely an amped up version. And the heat on this is actually pretty good. It's, it was like 1.5 something out of 2. Um, so yeah, that was surprising. Rough neck. And it is. It's a nasty punch. An LBX-20 smashing into you along with 3 ER mediums burning into your armor. It's, it's, a, it's, it's a good strike there. It's not the strongest strike. But it's 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 good enough to destroy components and bring down you know a hurt enemy. We are one damn. We're losing bad. We can't keep going on like this. 
One to four. We got one kill. They got four kills. They got five kills. This is the turning point right here. This is where things need to happen, and we need to start bringing down six. Nope. We're almost at the point of no return. Once it gets past six, that's that's basically it. And I'm trying to figure out which way to go. It doesn't matter. They know where I'm at. This black lantern, and uh, here he comes. Let's see if I can get him. He's hurt pretty bad. Acquired. Popped him once. Okay, I just blew off his freaking arm. Let's go for another one. Damn, how many times can I hit this guy with an LBX 20 before he goes down? Oh, there's another four times I've hit him with it. <laughs> oh, that's five times I've hit him with it. Let me get one more strike. Oh, don't get him away from bro. No! I missed him. We're going in. Ah, oh, you stole my kill. <laughs> that was my kill. I got a KMDD for that, so that's not bad. Oh, we're catching up. Nine. It's ten. What the fuck? Dow. Oh. Roadkill. Uh, 518 damage. You got four kill assists. Four four minute battle. Oh man, they annihilated us. But it's almost time for work now, so yeah. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Well, hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you next time. Fuzzy Nova out.